actually really chilly here in Florida. I'm gonna take Finley on my hot girl walk with me. Felt good to wake up in my childhood bedroom. And I'm so happy to be home. <laughs> You guys probably knew we had the sauna, but then I come home and we have a cold plunge too. I am terrified of it, but you know, the boys love it. Turn on the sauna, it feels so good. Cause it's actually cold out here in Florida, so it'll be kind of nice. I usually do 150 degrees. <laughs> it's just more my vibe. All right, let the games begin. Let's go do a quick workout and come and sweat. Okay, we're in the garage, AKA our makeshift gym. I'm gonna do this 20 minute full body on the Sculpt Society app because it's no cardio since I just went for a long walk. I love you, Megan. Here we go. That was great. I saw this quote recently. I don't know who said it. I think a lot of people say it in different ways, but it was just that the best workout, the most effective exercise is the one that you will do. However long that is, whatever the one that you will do consistently, whichever one that makes you feel good, whichever one you're in the mood to do is the most effective. And that like really changed my frame of mind because I feel like I always put so much pressure on myself to like go to these hour long workout classes or whatever and at the end of the day even like when I'm at home I'm not really motivated to go to like a fitness studio or anything as much I just kind of want to be home but I still can do a 20 minute workout in my garage on my phone so and I'm going to try and keep up with it the next few days or the next two weeks while I'm home and I think it's just a nice reminder that the most effective one is different for everybody because it just depends on what makes you happy and what you want to do. So that's my little motivation of the day. Let's go sauna. Here we go. It's a beautiful day outside. It's warming up a little bit. Finley, come over here. I'm going to the sauna, so I have to keep an eye on you, buddy. All right, let's see if it's heated up enough. Finley, I'm over here. Okay, she's hot. So sometimes I go in a bathing suit, but today I'm just gonna sit in my workout set because I find I sweat even more. I just take off my shoes and socks, obviously. Um, and I'm also trying to get off my spray tan so, so I can do a fresh one. <laughs> so it kind of helps. did about 35 minutes. I have sweat on my face. Feels good. My dad said he got me <laughs> cottage cheese. Oh baby, the best snack ever post-workout. Okay, you guys, you know how much I love the Juice Generation OPP smoothie. And right around this time of day, after I've worked out and done my morning, I crave this smoothie. So I'm gonna attempt to recreate it. Obviously, they don't have the recipe online, like how much of what, which I totally get, but there's no Juice Generation here. But you do a plant milk, so either almond or oat, strawberries, almond butter, banana, and 24 grams of chocolate plant protein. So my dad honestly had a lot of the stuff. Um, I'm kind of doing a little bit different. He said goat protein is 
really good for you. So I'm gonna do this, and it's unflavored, but he had cacao powder. So I'm gonna do 24 grams of this powder, and then add two scoops of the cacao. But cacao is not sweet. So that's so that's like my chocolate protein powder. I wish I knew like what protein powder they used. Then we're gonna do a banana. I'm gonna I'm gonna start. This is gonna be a trial run. So today, oh hello Finley. And then it calls for I do almond milk strawberries and then almond butter and that's the smoothie so we're gonna see i just didn't want to like necessarily buy chocolate protein powder if my dad already has this but and it, i i know it's not gonna taste exactly but today's gonna be our first trial run and we're gonna see how we can do it okay we've got strawberries in there i'm gonna do the full banana just because i want it to be sweet i'm literally just like raw dog in this like i do not know how much to do with what. I'm not a pro smoothie maker at all. Like, I don't know. We got almond butter. I got Finley a new hedgehog toy. So that's what you hear. What is the hack on getting that oil stuff off the top of like, I don't know how to. Okay. We're gonna start with this, but I'm just gonna keep tasting and keep adding as needed. Okay. Here goes nothing. Shake it up a little bit. Guys, I'm already like smelling it. And it just like doesn't even smell like it. Okay. It's not terrible. I'm gonna add more strawberries. Okay, I added ice and I added more strawberries. Let's see. That'll play, that'll play. Okay, I'm gonna drink this today, but I think I'm gonna freeze a banana and like wash the strawberries and put them in the freezer too just so it gives it more of that milkshakey feel, but this is pretty good. I have my smoothie. I have some work to do. I'm a happy girl. Okay, I'm very impressed with myself. It's a little bit later. I had some calls, got some work done, and my brother just got home. My aunt just came to town. My dad just picked her up from the airport, and we just kind of last minute decided, okay, let's go to dinner, and we're kind of going to a nicer Italian restaurant, so I was like, I need to do something with myself. And I'm very impressed with what I pulled together, so, I'm wearing this just like red, because you guys know I'm loving red right now, turtleneck from Revolve. And just some basic dark denim jeans, some like dark blue from Hudson. And I was like, how can I make this cuter? Accessories. So I added these earrings from Anthropology. I just did, like my brother was like, I swear if you go do your full makeup routine right now, because he's so hungry. I said, no, I won't. I just did like some concealer blush powder. Yeah. A little lip and I just pulled my hair back and a little ponytail because I showered earlier so I just kind of pulled it back love these bangles I think these are love AJ bag is Stella McCartney this is like my little holiday bag I'm borrowing it from forward and then to tie it all together they're gonna go crazy when I show my shoes <laughs> how we all doing out there I decided to tie it all together with these shoes we got a belt from Amazon Roan pants Totally recommend. We love round. $35 pair of shoes. Hey. And um, Tierra Yachts, because I sell yachts, so go Bucks. Go Bucks. Um, so that is the fit. That is the look. And see you guys there, or after, sometime. Wednesday morning and I just went for a long walk with my brother and Finley 
And now I'm gonna get another workout in. I think I'm gonna do something similar to the yesterday. I'm gonna do just like a little Sculpt Society. It worked out well yesterday. I just love the app, it's so easy to use. And I'm probably gonna do another quickie just cause that's what works for me. And then I'm gonna shower and we're doing a whole family mall day at International Plaza, which is my favorite place ever. Um, we're doing lunch there. We're all holiday shopping for kind of each other. So we're gonna have to like split off, but everyone wanted to go. So we're like, let's just all go the same day and we can like split off as needed. But yeah, so I wanted to get a workout in. This is day two out of two, getting a workout in with my mornings here. So I wanna keep it up. Let's see how far I can go with it. I kinda wanna do, I might do two different ones. I think I'm gonna do quickie arms and then quickie legs. I don't really feel like doing core today. It's just not in my, my journey. I think I'm gonna do six minute dancing arms. Gotta love a dancing arm. Oh my gosh, she recorded this at Las Ventanas when we were in Cabo together. I didn't realize this, so that's funny. Okay, and now I think I'm gonna do six minute standing legs. Since I did six minute arms, we'll do six minute legs. It'll be a little 12 minute workout. This one she filmed in a dorm room. <laughs> I love it, it's so cute. You don't need much space for this one, I guess. Whew, it was only six minutes, but those squats or like lunges, they always get me. You know what, I just got 12 minutes in, now I can go get ready for our family mall day. I wonder if Finley's waiting up here for me. Who's that? Hello. He's like, where have you been? I know. Okay, we are trying the smoothie again. Same thing as yesterday, just using this protein powder instead because it's actually chocolate. Let's hope this makes a difference. All right, let's give it a go. I just added some ice cubes too. I actually just forgot, realized I forgot to put in almond butter. Oh my God, this is a lot better. I might've put too many strawberries in. The chocolate protein powder helped so much. Oh my God, it tastes so much better. This is my little post-workout. Also with some cottage cheese because I'm craving it. All right, we are showered all ready for our mall day. I'm wearing Emma Leger's brand hat, Dirty Martini Club. And uh, I'm wearing Nike and Lululemon Lemon with uh, on running shoes and Reebok underwear. Oh, nice. I'm wearing a Skims long sleeve bag is Zara. I love this because I can fit like a water bottle and other stuff. Jeans are a gold day. And then I'm wearing my New Balance sneakers. This ring, I'm forgetting where it's from. Earrings are Love AJ, just did like, you know, everyday makeup. Here is the fit, it's super casual. It's kind of been my go-to recently, like when I'm having a bad hair day. I love wearing trucker hats with like my hair behind my ears, hoops. I think it's very chic. Mom, are you excited for our mall day? I am, actually. I like oh, your hat, I she know. bought it at Publix today. <laughs> I am. So perfect. And I just have time to wash my hair, so. Same, Here so it it's a hat day. Backseat crew, how we feeling? Good. We're gonna eat at Bazile, which is like the best restaurant in the International Mall, in my opinion. The French fries come with this like pink sauce. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. my mom literally just, her yeah, mouth yeah, is watering. Danielle rates restaurants based on their French fries. I do not rate restaurants based on their fries, but oh, if you do, that's fair too. No, I only, these are the fries. Like my friends and I, when we come home, it's like Bazile fries. Second floor, upstairs Nordstrom, in International Plaza. Looking so forward to it. Looking forward to it. Parking upstairs Nordstrom, of course, because it's the elite place to park. Because there's usually spots and Bazile is upstairs too. Honey, I'm home. <laughs> Whole squad rolling up to Nordstrom. <laughs> Guys, literally I've been here for five seconds and I just ran into Sydney Adams, Tampa Queen. I just met her mom and sister too. Um, her and I are hopefully hanging out next week, but she was here with her whole fam. I'm here with my whole fam. Oh, I love it here. Wait, this is totally different. Whoa, I love it. So there's an hour wait. So we're just gonna shop a little bit and then come back in an hour. 
Just bought some chubbies for my mom's boyfriend and this is the bag they give you. So I'm gonna be walking around like this. It's all a part of the experience, getting the e-bar latte. We have completed our journey, ended where we started. The sunset is stunning right now. We're back now. I'm gonna show you guys what I got at the mall today. I was just finishing up some Christmas presents, so I thought I'd show you guys or tell you guys. So like I said, I got my mom's boyfriend some chubbies. They're like the shorts that like go above the knees. He really likes those. I went to Altered State because I usually find really fun little stocking stuffers and little gifts for my mom and aunt, but honestly, I bought stuff for myself. I didn't see anything for them. Well, this I bought for the house because I love drinking out of a festive cup. And this one is so cute and it was on sale for $5 at Altered State. I love that store so much for little knickknacks and stuff. And I just want to drink hot cocoa <laughs> out of that. I realized I forgot to bring one of my Dermaplane facial things. So I figured I would just buy this Kitsch pack to have here. So whenever I come home, I have these because I'm noticing I'm getting a little bit more peach fuzz. It's growing back in. It, it always comes back like blonde or whatever, but I like to Dermaplanks, it makes my skin apply better, and I think I'm gonna get a spray tan on Friday, so I wanna be all ripe and ready for that. I'm in my hat era, clearly, um, and I bought this one. I feel cooler than I am. I don't own a Bronco. I've never driven a Bronco, but I loved this hat. I love any hat with like that rope trim, and it was for $15. Oh, it is not tight enough on me head. It's from the brand American Needle. I feel like I've heard of that. Ooh, ooh. This is so cute, especially during the summertime. I mean, now too, with like, literally I'd wear it with this outfit, but I just, I had, I had to get it. And then from Lululemon, I got a few things for a few different people. It was a one-stop shop. My mom loves her black Lululemon belt bag, and I know she wears a lot of white, so I got her this white kind of Sherpa one with the gold zipper because she wears a lot of white and this one's kind of more fun for winter. She goes for her hot girl walks every day and wears hers. I'm so glad she loves it so I got her one or an another one. And then I got my Aunt Debbie, she's over there, a black belt bag, her little starter kit for, she's been wanting to go for walks and she's like, what do you wear, what do I do? I'm like, just wear it because it's like cold in New York, she lives on Long Island. So I said get thermal lined leggings or fleece lined leggings, whatever high white socks so there's no space between your shoes and your leggings so there's no bare skin and then like a nice black jacket like a or just some sort of jacket like a fitness jacket and then a jacket over top and then a belt bag and she was like i don't have one because this is just so nice then your hands free you can put your keys your phone your wallet everything so i got her one because i love mine and then i got freddie this set from the lemon just like a little workout set it's this blue fitness shirt and then matching blue shorts and they have like a little I don't know if you guys a little print to them but they match with the blue of the top and then I also got him like a Herschel duffel bag and like a some golf accessories that was on a different day and then from Bath and Body Works <laughs> love Bath and Body Works I got this candle to burn in the like kitchen living room because our one Christmas tree scented candle is almost out. So I got fresh balsam. This is the only one they had left. It's so funny. They, I feel like they usually sell it in all different decor. It's the same scent, but a different print. And this is the only one they had. Oh, it just smells so good. And then I wanted one for my room too, but my room is like scents kind of overpower my room. And I'm not in my room all the time, but I just wanted a cute little winter one. So I found one called winter that I can burn in here because I have a lot of presents to wrap and stuff. And this one, there's definitely a little bit of like, oh, white woods, pine needles, clementine, clove, 
So it's still kind of that kind of vibe. But this one will be for my room. And that's what I got at the mall today. It was so funny. We all would like get lunch together and then split off. We split off and then we had lunch and then we split off again. <laughs> um, we were all hiding from each other. Like when we got in the car, we're all putting it in the trunk so no one can see. It was very funny. We've got Polar Express on, which is my absolute favorite Christmas movie. My favorite thing about it is the soundtrack. I love the music. Finley and Dad are having a glass of wine. Hi, girls. Over here, we're doing some baking, I guess you could say. This is the dessert we make every single year. It's so good. It's like a chocolate pudding layered cake. It's like graham cracker, chocolate pudding, graham cracker, chocolate pudding, and then graham cracker crumbles on the top, and it's so good. We use transported from Long Island, the mighty fine pudding. Ugh, it's so good. We usually make way, it like the day before. I know. We usually make it like the day before Christmas, but we want to enjoy it more because then on Christmas we're always so full, so we wanted to have it for like the next few nights to come. So we're making it. Wings o'clock, I see. Or whatever chicken that is. Nice. Organic. Organic. <laughs> Burning the new Organic fresh balsam important. candle. It's so good. And we smashed up all these graham crackers and they go on the top on a light layer and then we put in the fridge overnight so it cools and it is so delicious to the next day and it has layers of graham crack oh I literally look forward to this all year we only make it during Christmas time with this specific pudding that she brought and now we put it in the fridge we're on our daily walk Getting our steps in, right, Finley? Guys, oh my gosh, there's a turtle. I've never seen a turtle in my neighborhood. Literally ever. Finley kind of scared him, but Finley's also scared of him. Let's let him go, let's let him cross the sidewalk. He's so spooked. <laughs> It's an absolutely stunning day outside, oh my gosh. In the sauna now, I'm gonna be in here for 20 minutes. Made an element, electrolytes of course. Oh, I need to turn on the infrared. Now we're, now we're talking. Woo! I am beating of sweat, which feels so good. I have two more minutes. <laughs> good morning guys, I am cleaning out my jewelry armoire I have here because I haven't gone through it in forever and you guys like TBT tumbler days the double rings wow this is a time capsule this is when I tried to DIY and make my own ring I went to Michael's and I bought like whatever these are and then I glued them to rings Another double ring, I don't think I made this one. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, and this is like one of those knuckle rings that moves. <laughs> I really thought I was the bee's knees, literally. This one goes crazy. <laughs> Wait, I want this. You guys know how much I love the teddy bear emoji. This is staying with me. Also from the archives, found my old monogram necklaces. This one was like my OG one that I was obsessed with. And then this one was more of like that block letter vibe. Oh my gosh. She believed she could, so she did necklace. Some old cross necklaces. Oh my gosh. Guys, I just found gold. I have been craving the scent of Taylor Swift Wonderstruck. I did not know I still had this. Oh my god, I'm like nervous to sniff it. Oh my god. This just brought me back. I don't even know what year. I'm wonderstruck. Whoa. I mean, keeping that. Also, this one. The DKNY apple scent. Brooke and I were just talking about this on the podcast. I feel like I remember this. What was this one? 
Oh my god, Justin Bieber's perfume. Vera Wang Princess. This is giving OG YouTube right now. Please excuse my looks. I just had to turn on the camera. Ralph Lauren hot. I feel like this was like my going out perfume when I was younger. Oh, this is crazy. Love spell, Victoria's Secret, come on. I'm gonna smell all kinds of things. Oh, that just unlocked something in me. Abercrombie Emerson, I didn't know I still had all this perfume. This one, I felt so cool when I would wear. Wow, wow. I mean, I'm having a blast. So the jewelry Amour is now gone. My mom took it for her condo, which is exciting. Just made another protein shake today. We didn't have strawberries, so I just did banana, almond milk, chocolate protein powder, and ice. And the ice gave it more of that like milkshake consistency. This is kind of my favorite one I've done so far. Hello, Finley. Doing lots of clean out. Just cleaned out all these shelves because there had so much junk in there. And now I just have stuff everywhere, so I need to Figure out what to do. I just put this little thing I found on him. He looks so cute. About to hop on a call with our Gals in the Go team. and <laughs> I'm really tempted to do this. Also, the lighting in here is really bad because the window's behind me. So I put on this light, which is honestly extra because I need this. And I don't feel like charging it later. So, so we won't waste it for that. But this is Google Meet. Oh, I'm so doing this. This is so cute. Hello, it's a lot later. I had a couple calls and did some more cleaning out. And now I'm headed to my high school does a little like alumni happy hour for like certain years um, during this time of year, which is so fun. And tonight it's at Hyde House in Hyde Park, Hyde Park. And I've always wanted to go. It's kind of, I think it's like a social club workspace area. I don't know. But here's my fit. Any excuse I get to dress for a holiday party, I'm so pumped. <laughs> um, my friends were like, that dress might be a little too dressy, but they're also wearing dresses. And then I added the tights and boots, and they're like, okay, I think that's good. But I don't care. I'm always overdressed. So I just love this dress so much, and I want to wear it as many times as I can. It's from the brand Odd Muse. I just adore it. And then we're doing silver, so I did my coach bag. Earrings are anthropology. Black tights from Calcedonia. Steve Madden black boots, uh, leg uh, leggings, bracelets are love AJ, and yeah, we're going to um, Bar Taco first in Hyde Park before for like dinner and drinks, and then oh, someone's at the door. But I'm so excited, so let's go. Friday morning and boy oh boy did I get sneaky drunk last night. I like knew that was gonna happen because I haven't drank since the live show. I really like don't like to drink on the weekdays, but here I am on a Thursday night. Or like, you know, weekdays has whatever. <laughs> Thursdays are fun. And I had the best time with my friends. Like I just love my friends from high school so much. And then the uh, the reunion was so fun. I saw so many people I haven't seen in forever and just catching up and then we all like they were literally kicking us out of the venue at 9 p.m. and we were all like where are we going next I went up to these girls that were like two or three years old two years older than me three years older than me in call in high school and I was like you girls are still just as beautiful as you were in high school and I was so obsessed with you then and I'm still so obsessed with you guys now like I've always looked up to you guys and they were just shook because I was like being so random by going up to them and saying that but I just wanted to tell them because I've always looked up to them and I still do so it was that kind of night where I'm just like oh my god you know so it was fun then we went to like a random bar called Irish 31 in Hyde Park and you know we did the vibes and then we ended up at Steak and Shake and there was literally no one else <laughs> but we moved anyways I have looked better for sure and we're gonna see if my camera stays on the dash. I love driving, I love running errands. I can't believe I'm awake right now, but we have an important thing to do, which is getting a spray tan, so. So my hair's just up, 
because I find that if I keep my hair up in a bun and I like brush it through the scrunchie, it actually helps keep the volume. Like I'm trying to maintain my hair from yesterday. So that's why it looks like this. And when I get a spray tan, obviously you need to have your hair up. I've also found the perfect, I've like finally got my spray tan or just self tanning formula down. An exfoliating mitt has changed the game because it just gets every last bit of your last tan off so that your new tan is just perfect. Even like today, I, I had already scrubbed off my spray tan the last few days but I just went in the shower this morning, didn't even use soap, or I think I used like a little face wash just so it wasn't super dry, and just rub my skin. My skin is so soft right now, and it's ready. I am primed and ready for this spray tan. But yeah, tonight I have another holiday party with even more people from my high school, and just like people from Tampa that I've known for years, but tonight it's like more people our age only. Like last night was literally anyone that was an alumni, which was really cool actually. But tonight it's one of our friends from high school that's like having it, and. I heard she got a DJ, at least in the past, she's gotten a DJ and it's semi attire, which I love. So gotta figure out what I'm gonna wear. And I was just like, I wanna be tan cause you know, Christmas Eve is Sunday, Christmas day is Monday. And you know, it's just a festive time. Who knows where, what I'll be getting up to this weekend. But yeah, I'm just very thankful to be home. I can't, I'm like hungover, but I'm not because I'm just so happy to be home and to be in a car and running errands. Like I feel like I just need to go to Starbucks just to, you know, feel the suburb vibes. You guys are probably like, this girl is ridiculous, but you know what, it's the little things. And for me, I mean, I wish I was driving my Volvo. If you know, you know, I sold it when I moved to New York, but we're all like fighting over cars right now because guys, either rats or squirrels got into my dad's car while he was in New York for two days and like ate up a ton of the wires and his car is not working. So we're down a car. Um, so my mom's like letting us use her car. It's a whole thing. But I feel so bad for him because he, he takes such good care of his car. He was like, what did I do? And he literally can't control it. There were just rats or squirrels that were just... So, anyways, I'm feeling silly right now. I'm going to listen to some Christmas music. I'm going to go get tan. Happy Friday. I'm sorry. Hi, she's back. I did medium bronze. I go to South Beach tanning when I'm home. Hi, the person next to me is waiting, so I'm just gonna pretend like I'm on a FaceTime. Um, he literally gave me the nod like, wow, the serotonin I just got from being in my hometown spray tanning place was incredible. It did everything for me that I needed it to and more. And I'm just feeling silly. So I'll be able to shower this off in like four. I can shower, I did bronze because then you can shower it off sooner and it like develops. But like if you shower off clear, it still won't develop for 12 hours. So, and I need this for tonight. I'm already so tan, I'm so excited. Okay, just showered my spray tan off. It's settling in very nicely. I need to start getting ready, but I was like, let me figure out what I'm wearing before I start doing my makeup and hair. So this was like all my friends favorite. It's like a one shoulder situation and the attire is cocktail But like this is giving gown like it literally is a gown and It's so cute, but maybe I'll wear it on New Year's Eve or something because it's just feeling a little too fancy Okay, I just like love this dress and if I don't wear it today I have to wear it on Christmas or Christmas Eve because it's Like a red color which I feel like is perfect for the holidays I really might wear this tonight. I think it's like the perfect amount of like chic, but also a little sexy. I don't know what shoes though. Oh my gosh. Well, I could do my silver sling back heels and just do silver jewelry with my hair down, obviously. Um, I really like this. Okay, lastly, we have this little number from House of CB. It's just like a black faux leather, but it's like a body quan. It's like going to the club a little bit, so, but I do love it with these heels. I don't know, I almost need to like put on hair, and put on, put on hair, put on makeup and let my hair down and see what it looks like. I wonder if I added tights, if it would kind of give it more of a chic look. I don't know. Definitely leaning towards this dress, but I'm going to text my friends because I can't make decisions. Okay, my friends are actually saying two or three, but I feel like three is just too fancy. They're saying two. We have come to a decision, folks. I did a side part, which I just love a side part. Went with this dress with the tights. I think it's so chic, so cute. Added the silver heels. This dress is House of CB. 
earrings i love aj and we just went for big volume i want to bring this purse out but honestly it's not fitting everything and my friends want me to bring my digital camera and this bag doesn't fit it either so even though it's plain i think i'm gonna do this bag because i can put my camera and i just i want to take photos tonight of everyone and be that annoying friend so let's go i'll see what clips i get bringing some mom waters for the pregame then using this <laughs> love you guys getting on the boat Country music, yes. Good morning. We're going to Buddy Brew. I really want Buddy Brew. And Caitlin hasn't driven <laughs> since she moved to New York. How does it feel to drive? I feel kind of reckless. <laughs> she feels crazy. No, you're a great driver. We're in her high school car, and I missed it. My dad picked me up from my friend's house. Feels like when I was younger. Um, but we're uh, skirt skirting. Oh my gosh, I look so bad. We're gonna go to the Restoration Hardware outlet because I don't, or maybe you've been once before, but my dad's looking for a table for the house in like this little nook area, little breakfast table. So we want to see what we can find, if there's anything here. Oh, you don't want round? Ugh. Like this? Like I would have this in my house. Oh my God, no, this. <gasps> like this, this is kind of like my apartment. Ugh. You don't want round? I love round because no one's not included in the conversation. <laughs> we do have a round table oh my gosh these are so stunning i guess like they're like a little bit more damaged that's why they're here maybe that's nice too love this too yeah but it's a nice oval yeah this goes with that area because it's a little bit lighter hmm this is nice too but it's too dark I'm like, look at all these couches. You guys need to go to the hardware, the RH outlets. Home now, and that is the end of this vlog. I wanted to make sure I got a vlog up for you guys to watch, so be on the lookout for more vlogs. Um, there might be another Tampa vlog, or maybe I'll be in New York. We will see where the next vlog is. I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching. Merry Christmas, happy holidays, and I'll see you next time. I look disgusting. Bye.